Hey guys, Tech Squad here, and we're back for another video. And before we start this video, I'm just going to note that we're not always going to um, make videos with uh, the two of us, so my partner and I. It might be just me, or just him, or the both of us. So that's just a thing I wanted to note, so that you wouldn't be expecting the both of us all the time. So anyway, let's start our video. So in this video, we're going uh, we're gonna to show you um, a review of the iPod 5. This is just a case that I might say a few things from after. Probably not. It's just a regular case that I use for my iPod that is um, there for protecting it. So anyway, let's throw that aside. So here's this iPod. So this iPod's a very neat iPod. Let's start off with the uh, physical... Um, features of this iPod. So at the front here, you have a front view camera. Here's the screen that you use, and here's the square button or the home button that's used to. Um, uh, so if you're in an app, then you can uh, press that and it'll go to the home screen. There's many other things you can use with it too. At the back here, you have the back view camera, a flashlight right here, you have the Apple logo, the iPod sign, or writing, and then you have this little thingy right here, which is used, uh, which is like a loop that Apple made, it's a new feature that they made for the iPod 5, so if you flick it up, as you can see, there's a little hole there. You can, like, put a wristband around. You can put a wristband around it and attach it to your wrist. So if you're taking pictures from a balcony or something, the iPod will not fall off your hands. Almost certainly not fall off your hands. So, yeah, that's a pretty neat feature that Apple have added. So now we have the sides of the iPod. So on this side right here, we have the volume buttons. So, let me just show you. So, this one is to turn is to turn the volume up. This one's turn to turn the volume down. Now, on the other side, we have nothing here. Now, on the bottom, we have a speaker here. Let me focus that for you. Here we have a speaker here, the charging port, and a headphone jack. Now, at the top here, we have the on and off button. So those are all the physical features of this iPod. And also note that I got the blue iPod 5, but that doesn't mean that there is only blue that you can get. You can get many more colors than just blue for the iPod 5. Apple has made it so that you can so that there's a big collection of colors that you can get for the iPod 5 so that almost any color that you want can be put on the back, sides, front, and bottom. So yeah, that's a, that's a pretty cool feature that um, Apple have added to make it, you know, fun and colorful for the iPod 5. So now let's get to the actual iPod. So this iPod has a 4-inch Retina display. It's a very HD iPod. So, let's open up the iPod. So, bam. Here we go. Here is the home screen that, that the iPod. So, basically, this is what it starts off with sometimes. Like, the apps are sometimes switch switched around when you get the iPod. You can put... Um, the apps into folders too like I did here so if you just want to put tips in with podcast you just move it together and bam there it is it's in a folder you can also change the name of the folder and everything so that's that's a pretty cool cool feature so the this iPod 5 runs iOS 8.2 so that's the Cur that's what it uh, runs currently. There might be other updates, but that is the um, the current iOS used right now. So let's get off the uh, 
the folder mode or you can also do this to um, delete apps like if I want to delete it I just press this and then I can delete it right there but I don't want to delete it so I'll just press cancel and then press the home button and you're back so this iPod is um, a very neat iPod so let's just um, I'm just gonna review some of the um, some of the apps that it comes with so let's start off with the camera so this camera actually, um, uh, um, what's it called? Records videos in 1080p. So that's that's pretty cool. That's a pretty cool upgrade that Apple have made. So actually, the iPod itself can um, record, can uh, take a picture of a, can do a panorama picture, which is a a neat little um, feature that Apple have added. So. Okay, so basically, I'm going to show you guys how the panorama works. So first of all, we, before we do an example picture of the panorama, I'm just going to tell you a bit about a, pan about a panorama. So a panorama is made to, is, is like a really wide photograph that is made uh, for um, taking pictures of uh um, things that are really wide. So say a football field, that's a really wide, um, that's a really, um, wide place. And if you want to take a picture of the football field, then a panorama would be good because you can just, um, you, you click the, um, uh, the, the uh, button to take a picture. You move the camera from left to right and it'll capture the whole width of the field. So that's a pretty neat feature. So I'm going to show you how that'll work now. I'm going to try to do this holding the camera at the same time. So you press that. And then you move the camera slowly. As you can see right here, it's capturing the picture. As you can see here, it looks a bit weird because my room is really small and it's going all the way around my room. But when you have like a really wide, um, when you have like a really wide, um, place that you want to take a picture of then uh, panorama will do the trick so that's a really neat feature that Apple have added actually and yeah so that's basically it guys there's not much else to the iPod 5 except that let's just say one more thing so there's a big collection of apps that you can get there's so many different categories of apps and many people say that it's um uh, one of the best um, uh, app stores it's not like it doesn't have PC features like Windows or like I was saying on the HP stream 7 it doesn't have like PC features like Windows but it's a pretty good um, device and iOS is actually a pretty good software so yeah it's also very thin and light you can carry it in your pocket you will barely feel anything so yeah, it's actually a very um, neat, small, and portable device that you can use whenever, basically. So that's basically it, guys. We hope you enjoyed our review on the iPod 5. Give a like if you like the video, and always subscribe. We'll see you on our next video. Bye!